The next display of the day was a de Havilland aircraft flypast that has probably never been seen anywhere else in the world. The majestic DH-98 Mosquito took to the air to be joined by two de Havilland DH-115 Vampire Jet Trainers and a single de Havilland DH-112 Venom Jet Fighter. While the formation featured a piston engine aircraft, the Mosquito and three jet aircraft, there are far more similarities between the aircraft types than at first appears. The Mosquito made its first flight in 1940, while the Vampire first flew only three years later in 1943, although it only became the second operational jet fighter with the RAF after the end of World War II. While the Mosquito is essentially a wooden aircraft, the Vampire is of mixed wood metal construction, though the construction of the Ford cockpit area is very similar to that of the Mosquito. The Venom, which was developed in 1949, is also of mixed wood and metal construction, which certainly harks back to its Mosquito and Vampire ancestry. Well-known New Zealand warbird pilot Brett Emini, flying one of the two vampires in this formation, was especially pleased to be a part of the display. His father, Cliff, flew Mosquito fighter bombers in Burma during the Second World War, eventually being shot down and captured by the Japanese. While many Kiwi airmen flew the Mosquito with the RAF during the Second World War, it was not until 1947 that the Royal New Zealand Air Force purchased and began to receive the first of 89 Mosquitoes, operated by No. 14 and 75 squadrons. The last RNZAF Mosquitoes were retired in early 1952 when they were replaced in service by the de Havilland Vampire. <laughs> 